people of North Queensland are used to preparing for cyclones. They know that they've got to tie down all outdoor objects, moor up boats. Uh, we found one caravan park owner throwing his outdoor furniture into the pool and he insisted that it was in the Caravan Park Association guidebook as the best place for the furniture to be is underwater. Uh, down at the marina, you can see uh, the boat owners busily and frantically either tying up their, their yachts and trawlers or others shifting them further out to sea where yesterday uh, three boats sank even before Cyclone Anthony had hit. And certainly it did hit. It came a bit earlier than uh, the Bureau of Meteorology had forecast and it was about nine o'clock at night that we were standing in the main street of Bowen where the wind shrieks and rattles and roars. There's a pitch like the standing next to a screaming jet engine. It claws at the roofs and it lifted pieces of sheet metal off the nearby pub. And it's that threat of flying debris, the thought that a piece of tin flying through the sky could act as a rogue piece of guillotine that's most terrifying, that's most lethal. You can, if you face into the wind, it's an effort to brace yourself against the breeze. It, you get these intense gusts that physically lift you off your feet and threaten to bowl you down the street. So this morning, uh, SES crews and Ergon quickly moved in and they were busily chainsawing and hacking and pulling away the trees and uh, whacked in a new power pole. Down at the marina, uh, boat owners were uh, towing their sunken boats uh, closer to a beach to try to make some, uh, to clear the shipping way and also to try to sort of survey the, the damage. But overall, they know that this was just a puff of wind compared to what's to come. Some of them describe it as a junior burger to the Big Mac double meal deal that's on its way. I'm standing here looking out to sea now over, um, you know, there's, there's white caps and dark black clouds, but you kind of wonder if you stare at the horizon, you wonder if just what is out there.